Mary. Hello, SpongeBob's house. SpongeBob speaking. Hello, SpongeBob. Hello? Did you remember to buy Bitcoin on the dip like I told you to? Hey everybody, welcome back to the channel. I'm Satoshi Sean, I'm glad you're here. Uh, if it's your first time here, please hit the subscribe button and the bell for notifications. I uh, try to get out a couple videos a week. I'm really excited about this one. Um, I'm not going to hide that I'm excited about it. I'm going to go over it, but I'm not your financial advisor. This is only my opinion. Um, you should do your own research. Um, we're going to go over uh, tachyon. We're being hit by a field of energetic tachyons penetrating the hull. Location, deck 10, forward. Right alert. Which, like I said, I, I'm very excited about it. Uh, they reached out to me and asked me to, take, to check it out. I did, and I'm really, really blown away. Um, I think this is going to be something really, really revolutionary. Uh, huge revolutionary. Like, Bitcoin changed the game. Um, it's kind of like Henry Ford making the horseless carriage. There were already, you know, horse-drawn carriages. It completely changed it. This is going to do that for the information superhighway or for the internet. Um, it's a Ron Burgundy project. It's, it's a big deal. I don't know how to put this, but I'm kind of a big deal. Really? People know me. Um, all right, let's jump into Tachyon. Now, one of the reasons I'm really excited about it is because whenever anyone talks about some great project that's going to change everything, it's always a huge, huge deal. Um, it's a massive undertaking. It's aggressive and all those other buzzwords. This is doing that, but it's not, it's not doing it alone. It's not, it, this is, this project isn't technically just coming out and saying we're going to do this. It's the final piece of a puzzle or the final part of a plan that people have been working on for years with other projects coming together. That's another reason why it's so exciting. Um, <laughs> so Tachyon is going to build a decentralized internet protocol, building next generation of TCIP um, to empower blockchain infrastructure. Now this infrastructure and tokenize a protocol with 50 million users. How do they get the 50 million users? I'll tell you. I really need to kind of break this up, so just bear with me. And it's really, really technical. This is actually the third time I'm doing this video because the other ones just really, really get technical. I'm gonna try to keep it as simple as possible so you guys can check it out, read the white pager, do your white pager, one pager or white paper, and do your own research. Now there's three different companies here, three different uh, projects. Um, one is V-Systems, okay? V-Systems uh, is a DeFi ecosystem. It's a, it was the first general purpose blockchain database made by Sunny King. Sunny King is also a member of the team here. The teams on all these projects are amazing. If you don't know who Sunny King is, he invented proof of stake. So he's got that going for him. Um, one of the smartest guys you really haven't heard about. It's uh, V Systems. Uh, their coin is VSY. The VSYS, I think. Uh, it's top five staking coin. It's uh, top thirty in coin market cap. They've been around for years. So this is a tried and true, real project that has made it. They laid the groundwork. Okay. Now security and anonymity is coming through XVPN. XVPN is one of the largest VPNs out there. They have over 50 million users now. Uh, they're one of the top 20 mobile apps, and they have like 2.5 million downloads of their app a, a, a month. So they're huge. Um, Discover. Uh, I'll put links to XVPN, and you can uh, check them out. You can get their VPN. Um, if you're not using a VPN, you should be using one, period. Uh, <clears throat> but I'll tell you why XVPN is really good and why it's going to be really good with Tachyon because it's decentralized. And then V Systems, uh, I'll put a link in there. It's 
all coming together here under Tachyon. So what Tachyon is going to do is they're going to build on vSystems and use the XVPN to create this amazing new internet. Um, it will be 200% to 1,000% faster than what you're used to. Um, not just faster. It's going to be faster. It's going to be more secure and more stable and more reliable. Uh, it says it's going to put up a, it says 90% connection uh, right on week, on a weak network. It said 85, I think, in the white paper, but still 85, 90. And 95% more stable networks in a complex network work environment. I wonder whether, this is like 20, 20x faster uh, to, to 100 times faster. I wonder where they got that number from or how they figured that out. By the current speed would have to be at least 20 times faster than our maximum warp. How do they open the conduits? The board ship emitted some kind of high energy tachyon pulse just before we saw the subspace distortion. Um, I'm going to put they have a little video explainer. I'll put that in here at the end of it. Like I said, it's very technical. There's a lot of uh, a lot of abbreviations and acronyms thrown at you. Um, the problems with you know the internet now basically it's slow and it's not safe. And we go over all this, but it's slow and it's not safe. Uh, HTTP, they lack security. They're vulnerable to penetration, hijacking. TLS has high deployment costs and learning costs. Uh, the transportation level with TCP. Uh, TCP is three-way handshake mechanism, creates congestion and waste bandwidth. The internet um, IP addresses are often, they're, they can be tracked, obviously, because they're connected to a physical address. And uh, data links are ethernets. But this is still going to use Ethernet. Now, VPNs, one of the big deals, like I said, you should be using a VPN because it um, gives you that security, it hides you, um, gives you the privacy, but it's not trustless, which is what blockchain and especially crypto is all about, that trustless interaction. So you don't have to have any trust. You're still putting your trust and all your trust in that centralized VPN provider. So they have all your information. They know where you've been. Um, they can make compromises when it comes to retention laws and data requests. Um, also, they're really slow if you use VPN. Um, network stability is not guaranteed, and the speed varies. Sometimes you can be, you can work all right. Sometimes it can slow your system down really, really bad. So, how one of the ways this is going to work is it's going to take your information packets that are going back and forth. And it will change them and make it look different to other people. So it, it, you may send, you know, a bunch of different documents and it'll look like you're sending a Gmail or it'll look like a uh, YouTube. Um, so the HTTP layer is the application layer that'll go to ACK, TCP to UDP. And then IP is PP, IOP, DHT, or the internet layer just goes to IP. Like I said, you use Ethernet for both. Um, <clears throat> I'm going to get the white page, one pager, but uh, so how it works now, like this bad guy can intercept it when it's going back and forth, but it's going to be encrypted, so they won't be able to do that. Um, they'll conceal the IP packet and simulate the, these different protocols in the traffic. So like an SMTP will look like Gmail and HTTPS will look like you're visiting YouTube when you're actually visiting a secure server site, supposed to be secure server, server site. Very technical, but on the back end of it, um, it will be seamless because their software development kits will integrate with all standard uh, APIs and support all popular languages and systems. So you won't have to give up something to be able to have that security um, and use a blockchain. So, you know, it's, basically you'll be using blockchain, you won't know you're using blockchain. It'll just be faster and more secure. Uh, now, the uh, use cases for tacking protocol, VPN, obviously, um, content delivery network, decentralized storage, domain, uh, name service, Internet of Things, and DeFi. The numbers that are on this are, are insane. I, I thought, honestly, that like centralized st storage, like cloud storage and stuff like that was a, a bigger market than VPN. VPNs took in, I wrote it down, $23 billion this year. 
$23 billion this year, and the growth rate is 15%. Um, CDN was $6 billion, storage $9 billion. Still, $9 billion, it's not bad. 9,000 millions, that's pretty good. Um, so a massive market. They already have a built-in uh, user base with partnering with, uh, with XVPN. Now the tokenomics, they're going to have the IPX token, which is gonna be a utility token to run their system. It'll be on the vSystems blockchain, obviously, because that's what it's built on. It's pretty simple, you, you want more bandwidth goes through this, the, they have a, a node. They're gonna have like 5,000 uh, plus nodes. All right, a roadmap. I think it's about time for me to head over. They do have a DAO, uh, set up a decentralized autonomous organization that uh, will be able to vote on everything. The voting mechanism is a simple majority, so it's just a 50% plus one. There's three ways to vote, yes, no, or not voting, abstain. All right. Um, one over V systems, one over XVPN. Uh, the trustless, like I said, a trustless VPN, it's kind of the perfect, it's best of both worlds. You're getting everything with a VPN, but you're not trusting the VPN <laughs> with everything. Um, so nobody can, you know, strong arm the VPN. Um, one over the different speeds, 5,000 to different nodes. All right. Uh, standard API for easy integration with all blockchains. Uh, went over the IPX community governments. Uh, like I said, their DAO, it's a 50 plus, 50% plus one. Um, vote yes, no, or uh, abstain. The roadmap, the roadmap is very fast. So I think it's really impressive, but it's believable <laughs> because so much has already been done they're not going to build it from the ground up. They're building on top of these systems and uh, and XVPN. So, so much is already done. They're kind of, like I said, they're the final piece in creating this massive disruption that's going to be, I think it's going to be awesome. Anyway, um, so Q4 right now, we're in the end of 2019. It's going to be listed on, they said, major exchanges. Um, when it looks, at, you look at the uh, exchanges that uh, that V Systems Coin is on. It's, I'm sure it'll be on some decent ones. Um, and then Q1, which is right around the corner, um, they're gonna have their alpha release, and they're gonna reach 100,000 daily active users, and the provider node staking will start. This is Q1. Bam. Q2 beta release. Um, and then we're gonna reach 500,000. And then Q3, you're gonna release the uh, decentralized VPN and a general uh, general release with a million. So they're gonna double. They're gonna, whatever five is, octuple, I don't know. And then they're gonna go to a, to a million daily active users and they're gonna release Tachyon software development kits. That's less than a year, that's Q3. So every quarter they're jumping ahead. Um, and then Q4, still before the end of the year, they're going to do, do the uh, Tachyon decentralized VPN 100% rollout with a stable release. So after all the testing, they want to reach 2 million daily active users and integrate into the uh, VSYS, which is the token for V systems. <laughs> There's a lot of abbreviations here. Um, their DeFi ecosystem. All that's coming one year. Um, bam, 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 bam. And then 2021 uh, attacking on protocol support, more content storage and content delivery networks, DeFi, instant communication, edge computing, and gaming. That's another thing I didn't go over. It's one of the one of the uh, options, the possibility. One of the use cases was gaming. Um, that is about it. Also, check. I'll put links to the uh, to their website. Um, their everyone has their own um, social media, so check out Tachyon. Check out uh, XVPN. I think you can get it for free on the download. 
and vSystems, uh, all their, yeah, down here, all their stuff. There is one more thing. Well, one more thing besides that I'm going to play their, uh, their introduction video. Um, they're having an airdrop uh, that is coming up. I'll leave a link to the, I think it's Bitcoin, Bitcoin talk page. They're going to drop it on 15 exchanges right now. Might be more. Uh, so check out the uh, the link I put in the description. So you can get some Tachyon uh, tokens for free. Uh, that's about it. I'll go ahead and start that video. Um, I'm still Sean. It was good hanging out with you. Check out Tachyon. I'll put the links in the description. Uh, do your research. And here comes the video. Captain, I'm picking up a Tachyon Surge. With Tachyon Booster Protocol, the data transfer speed can be 10 times faster than before. How to do it? It has been 35 years since TCP IP protocol was used for internet on January 1st, 1983. TCP IP is slow, insecure, waste of resources. It can no longer fulfill the needs for today's internet communication. This smart routing system, through AI to calculate the best route and transfer strategy. Utilizing the blockchain technology, the new nodes receive their ID through the hash value that returns, verified by the POS, and then their address will be updated to the route list. Using the reforged UDP protocol to replace TCP protocol. Combined with ACK managing, FEC, and bandwidth auto-scaling techniques, it will optimize the transfer reliability of UDP. Tachyon Booster UDP is capable of increasing the internet transfer speed by 1,000%. Nowadays, it is effortless for hackers to monitor the internet activities of yours. Nevertheless, with the protection of Tachyon Security Protocol and Tachyon Anti-Analysis, we will keep your personal data out of hackers' reach. Tachyon Security Protocol will encrypt the data with multiple unparalleled decryption algorithms and further increase the data security by disguising the transfer protocol HTTP, HTTPS into FTP, SMTP, NFS, or others. It will also ensure an 80% connectivity success rate on weak networks. Tachyon Anti-Analysis will greatly reduce the risk of node capture attack via dispersed concurrent transfer and multi-relay strategies. Tachyon Protocol Tachyon Protocol will serve its role in many areas such as public blockchain, financial services, gaming, VPN, CDN, intelligent marketing, cloud storage, fraud computing, and IoT. Tachyon, next generation blockchain internet protocol suite and ecosystem.